This is the Remote Work Life Business Spotlight, where I highlight top remote business innovators and share personal and career development tips to help you navigate the world of remote work. I'm your host, Alex Wilson Campbell. I help remote work managers, professionals, and freelancers overcome isolation and uncertainty in their life, to get hired and fulfill their career goals. Today, I'm looking at and featuring a company called Showbiz Cheat Sheet. And as ever, um, I don't really de dive deep into a particular website or business before I record this particular uh, feature on the podcast. Um, and for those who don't know, the Remote Work Life Business Spotlight is all about featuring um, remote businesses from across the world. And as I said, today I'm looking at a company called Showbiz Cheat Sheet, and you can find them at cheatsheet.com. And when you land on their website, it's set up very much like a blog, some, uh, like a magazine. So, and there's different categories from TV to celebrity, or mainly TV and celebrity. So there's entertainment as well, exclusives. So it's very much set up like a, a blog, what to watch as well. So it's, yeah. Celebrity, yeah, I mentioned celebrity before, didn't I? So, and it looks like they they churn out a lot of content. So, royal family is another category that they have, and they've got some pictures of Meghan and Harry on there. They've got a music section as well. So, this might be one for the writers out there. Um, so, movies, and I think I I hope by doing the remote work life business spotlight, it gives you an understanding of what's out there. Um, it gives you an understanding of how you can approach a business, whether you want to work for the business as, as an employee or with the business as a contractor, freelancer, consultant, whatever that may be. So cheatsheet.com, let's have a look in a bit more detail. And of course, I always ask myself certain questions when I'm doing my due diligence on a particular business. Several questions I ask, what do they do? I think we've kind of um, covered that um but not in detail obviously it's, it looks like as i said it looks like a showbiz blog a showbiz newsletter blog um yeah different categories as i mentioned before we're looking at the menu section it's very much about showbiz and celebrity and what to watch and music and movies that's what i think uh showbiz cheat sheet is so that's what they do but i want to find out let's close this down here um, I want to find out a bit more about, about the business behind, you know, the, 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 what's behind the business. And by that, I've just scrolled to the bottom of their website and looking at the about us section. And they say here, get to know showbiz, showbiz cheat sheet. Um, they say at showbiz cheat sheet, our goal is to delight our millions of visitors with all things showbiz, including the latest entertainment and celebrity news, exclusive interviews, television and movie reviews, and behind the scenes content that connects the viewer to the big screen. From guilty pleasure um, uh, reality shows like The Real Housewives of New York City, and Keeping Up and Keeping Up with the, Cardis with the Cardassians, to fan favorite franchises like Star Wars and Marvel Cinematic Universe. So that's what they're about. Here's a picture of some of the team members. And as I, as I was alluding to, uh, lots of the team members are writers, staff writers, um, senior staff writers. They write about TV. Um, managing editors here as well so it gives you a clue as to who is behind all of this there's quite a few writers there actually so as i said to you before if you're a writer this could be for you this could be the the um the 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 website or the business where you begin your due diligence you begin your research they've got authors as well more staff writers and you know if you have expertise in any of those areas i mentioned around uh, TV, celebrity culture, music, then have a look at uh, cheatsheet.com. And 
Yeah, another question I answer is what I mean, problems they solve, I mean, problems they solve, I guess, is keeping you up to date with the latest in um, celebrity, uh, uh, what's going on in the world of celebrities and TV, music, etc. those different areas. I want to know a bit more about when they were established, though. Um, where did it all start? That's another question to ask yourself. What's the backstory uh, of the business? We've covered who the people are. What's the value? What are the values behind the business? Let's see if we can find out a bit more about that because that's always nice to know before you join a particular business. And sometimes, if you look in the career section where I'm heading now, you can understand a bit more about the organisation, the backstory, the values, the principles of the business because that's often part of the narrative in job descriptions or in job adverts. So, by the looks of this, they're looking for a few different types. Of, of writers at the moment a few few different positions are open and it tells you well basically um it's all about finding writers at the moment for this particular business they give you the hiring process as well which is all, always very handy they talk about the accolades that they've they've uh, received uh they've received an accolade um from running remote um, for a vibrant remote culture, or they've at least been shortlisted for a, a, a vibrant remote culture, which is something, definitely. Great place to work, certified between Jan June 2022 and June 2023. And in 2020, an Inc. Best workplace. So, yeah, they've got something going on there. What they say here as an organization, we do work our readers care about deeply because we educate passionate fans about the topics they love. Our team is made up of ambitious, talented people who love playing to win. So that's, again, points to some of their, their values. They play to win. To us, to win, again, there's that word, is to work together, another value. As a team, to improve continuously, another one, while never underestimating the influence and power uh, quality, accountability, and adaptability has on our end results. So, yeah, don't just bypass all of the words that they've used there. Think about how you can demonstrate to them um, how you fulfill those particular uh, values, those particular attributes yourself. They're going to say, as much as, as such, we hire self motivated individuals considered to be skilled in their fields. We recognize it is their contributions that enable our company to inform and entertain the world to make it smarter a happier happier one as we pursue pursue our vision of being the number one sought out site in each of our content categories so yeah they're they're very competitive they want to they want to win they want to be the best but they want to deliver quality but they also want you to be accountable uh, for the work that you do as well um, let's have a look. They talk about the bra the different brands as well. They've got a sport sports casting brand. Wow, as well. I'll look at that a bit later on. But yeah, um, I'm getting a bit distracted by the sports casting because sports is something that I really like. And I'm having a cheeky look, the career section in the sports the sports website to see if they are right, it leads you back to the yeah, okay, it leads you back to the same page, the same careers page. But yeah, sport is another area. I think it's worth definitely digging deeper in this into this website. Um, they talk also about the benefits and perks, flexible time off program, virtual workplace. So no commuting to work here because flexibility rules at um, at Endgame three hundred and sixty. I think that's that's the holding name. That's the overall name for their business cheat sheet. That they, they, they have the Endgame is, I guess, their main brand and. In underneath that, sorry, Endgame is the name of their company, and underneath that um, company, they have different brands. Cheat Sheet being one of them, the sports one that I just mentioned being another. So that's why they refer to themselves here as Endgame 360. Um, at Endgame 360, you are welcome to work from anywhere, your home, a coffee shop, or even the beach. Uh, we can, we can more about we. Oh, a bit of a typo there. They need to correct that. 
we can more about high quality results than your location. I think what they mean is we care more about high quality results than your location. Uh, in space, time, while you create things our readers love. So yeah, uh, lots of benefits to look through there. They talk about their culture as well. So have a look at um, uh, at uh, Cheat Sheet, Showbiz Cheat Sheet, um, aka endgame360.com. That's it for today's episode of the Remote Work Life Podcast. Click the link in the show notes below to access a free list of 100 remote businesses that hire regularly. And if you're feeling stuck or uncertain on issues of career or personal development, head on over to www.remoteworklife.io where you can watch exclusive on-demand video featuring real-world remote work leaders and future of work experts on key remote work topics, including how to get clarity on your career direction, how to thrive while working remotely, how to network effectively and stay connected, and how to tend to your personal and career development needs. Go to remoteworklife.io now and remember to connect with me, your host, Alex Wilson-Campbell, on YouTube, LinkedIn, and Facebook.